This video will show you how to reinstall Cookin while keeping your recipes safe. First, we'll create a backup file in Cookin by clicking File, Backup. We'll name the file uh, Recipes and save it to the desktop. My data was successfully backed up. I'll now save the automatic backups Cookin has already created. In the Documents Cookin Backups folder, we see four previously created backup files. I'm going to save them all to the desktop. In fact, I'll rename this Old Cookin Backups and save. Oh, it moved. I'll save it to the desktop. Now I can uninstall Cookin. Control panel, uninstall a program, find Cookin, and click uninstall. Now I'll delete any Cookin folders in my documents directory. I need to close Cookin first. Now I can delete Cookin and the Cookin backups folders. To reinstall Cookin, I click on the Cookin version 10 exe file found on the CDs or downloaded from help of support. I will skip those. Click Next. Click Finish, and I'll allow Cookin to run. Cookin has restarted. As you can see, my recipes aren't here any longer. To bring them back, I click File, Restore, and I go to my desktop, and I select the most recently created CKN file. I do want to continue. I know this file has my recipes. My data was successfully restored and will restart cooking now. Now cooking has restarted and my personal recipes are back in cooking. That's it.